I'm Larry Anglisano reporting for Aviation Consumer. Some owners may be hesitant to upgrade to an advanced navigator like Garmin's GTN 750 or 650 because of the learning curve that tags along. But what they may not realize is that Garmin offers factory training here at their Olathe, Kansas Learning Center. I recently took the GTN 750-650 course, found it to be comprehensive, if not fast moving. Here's Garmin's Chris Benson. It's a two-day course. Uh, generally, we start out on the first day talking about the G500, G600 install. And then we also then move into the second day talking about the GTN 650 and 750 and their features. Originally, when we offered the course, it was done as, as a 750, GTN 750 and 650 standalone course. But as our customers started coming in, uh, many of them, not only when they were doing their GTN 750 and 650 upgrade, they also um, installed, they took the opportunity and time to install a G500 and 600. So that's why in the second year of offering this course, we've decided to go ahead and, and offer that G500, G600 training as well. We try to initially focus on primary flight display operations, then we move into multifunction display operations. We also cover abnormal procedures, what happens if your air data computer fails? What happens if your AHARS computer fails? And really focus the customer on, on understanding that, hey, your standby instruments are still there as a backup. Um, and then for the 750 course, we really touch hard on flight planning scenarios. Um, in case ATC gives you a diversion or they give you a reroute, we really want the customer to feel confident in knowing how to operate their avionics because the last place where you want to learn how to do that, of course, is in the air. At each of the students' learning stations, we have on their desk an actual GTN 750 as well as a GTN 650, and we have the G500 or G600 um, display unit. This allows the user to interface with the actual product in a, a demo mode type setting. So the software that's loaded um, on these units allows the user to change the aircraft position, give it airspeed and altitude, so they can actually see how the avionics are interacting with each other. The course is offered currently uh, once a month. To find out more information about the course, you can go online to Garmin.com and within the In the Air section on the website, there's a seminars tab that lists all of the different seminars that we have across the country. Um, this seminar is special though, it's only offered here currently at the Garmin campus. Um, maybe in the future we'll take the, uh, the GTN training on the road. By coming in into the classroom environment, um, everyone is, is on the ground able to learn and, and use the interactive equipment. Um, hands-on equipment so that way they do feel confident when they go back out to their aircraft. Um, they can uh, feel confident in those ATC reroutes, uh, loading airways, um, planning for diversions, and that's what we try to accomplish here um, in the classroom environment. For a full report on Garmin's factory training, you can read the December 2013 issue of Aviation Consumer Magazine. Reporting for Aviation Consumer, I'm Larry Anglosano. Thanks for watching.